Hello everybody, my name is Kai Juno and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance. It's been a while since we played this, but I needed to upload something for July, so here we are. I already recorded one game where I played as Eden and it was a really good run, but then I realized in post that I you can't hear any of the game's audio. All you hear is my audio and it sounds like I'm just like talking to myself the entire time. But we're back again to record yet another one, so... It's okay, it's fine. We're trying to do unlocks. I technically have unlocked many things on every character, but as you can see, I don't have any marks for like Blue Baby, Eve, Samson, and that's because during the co-op that was released, I did not listen to the devs and I did not make a save file in my computer for this, so everything was gone. I still have all the unlocks, I just don't have all the marks, so we'll be, we'll be messing around with that today. Let's see who we're playing. Oh, I hate Eve. All right, let's do this. What we're doing? All right, let's do it. Get him! Get him! So yeah, I I've been lazy. I haven't been recording anything lately. As you guys know, I've been playing a lot of Roblox games, uh, games like Forgotten Memories, and recently I've been playing one called <laughs> Don't Hate Me, but. <laughs> I've been playing one recently called Five Nights Tower Defense, which if you don't know, that is a tower defense style game where the, ooh, I would not mind both of these, but I don't really have any money right now. That is a tower defense game where the animatronics from Five Nights at Freddy's are handed guns and are defense captains, basically. It's basically Balloons Tower Defense 6, but with Five Nights at Freddy's animatronics. I did not go and see what my what my item room was. But yeah, I've been playing the crap load of that. I've played so much of it that I even made a stat sheet for the community. <laughs> it's if I could check the amount of playtime I have on a Roblox game, I guarantee you I'd have over a week. But we're not playing that today. We are playing The Binding of Isaac. Ah oh, man. Well let's just let's hope that whatever's in our item room makes it worth it recently i uh got back from vacation i went oh we could play the sack room a little bit i actually kind of want to go in here oh good job spider i went to tennessee gatlinburg stayed in a cabin in the middle of the woods it was very terrifying not a lot of things to do in the cabin there was like pool and everything but the wi-fi was so bad up there so we didn't even really do much i'm just gonna use this now we have a heart sitting in the uh in the boss room Ooh, all right all right things are starting to pick up a little bit let's see what's in our item room i love it dog tooth is such a beautiful thing although i don't really struggle with finding secret rooms it's always the super secret rooms that i struggle with but this also works with crawl spaces and stuff like that should be a... Yep, to the left. It's to the left. Let's see if we can get this pot, too. Alright, okay. What, what a floor. What a floor. Let's go play the sack room a little bit. Get some, get some money. See if we can pick up something from the uh, shop. Alright. Jeez Louise, that movement speed's on 10 now. Yeah, super secret rooms to the right over there. Oh no, it's up, huh? Oh no, that's just for the secret room, sorry. Yeah, no, went to Gatlinburg. It was a lot of fun, I'll admit, it was a lot of fun. A little expensive though, I went to, I went to a place in uh, Pigeon Forge where we went go-karting. Secret rooms up above. We went go-karting, and then after that, we went to a putt-putt place right next door. I shouldn't have used that. I'm going to go over here now. Uh, these are never really worth it, but yeah. Actually, you know what? This was, this was worth it. Let's blow these up, get into the secret room. Oh, yeah, it was worth it. We have enough to get a uh, premium item. I'm not going to use my last bomb on that. We should save our last bomb in case we see a tinted rock. 
yeah, went to Pigeon Forge, did that. And then we went to this one place where we literally did, like, a Forged in Fire blade making. With the help of, like, from someone that's actually trained in doing that, obviously. It was really nice. It was really nice. I will post pictures of it into my Discord so everyone else can see. It would be nice to get Petrified Poop here. Next day after that, we went to a place called Anakistas, which is like a, an amusement park, like in the mountains. It's a lot of fun doing that. I, oh yeah, baby! <laughs> Super secret room should be to the right of here. Still, oh. <laughs> oh, good fun game. Let's go see our shop real quick first. So yeah, Anarchy says it was a, it was a lot of fun. There's like multiple little places that you can see there. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. I definitely had my expectations set low, unfortunately, for it. All right, got some range. I'm okay with that. Um, I don't think I want to do that right now. Both with grabbing another bomb in, in this card, though. Ooh, this will allow us to nuke the boss real quick. Yeah, no, it was like $38 for admission. And I was like, oh, man, that's $38 plus whatever else I'm going to be doing. And I just did not feel... Uh, uh, that allows us to at least protect our Devil Deal chances. I got four hearts, so I'll probably go Devil Deal. All right, and we get and I get a lot of HP. Yeah, we should we should go Devil Deals. We have a lot of HP to play with. But yeah, it was surprisingly a crap load of fun. Oh hell yeah. Um, I don't have a key. Oh, that's all right. We're just gonna try to beat. Go to either Blue Baby or the Lamb. Curse of the Darkness. But we have this. Uh, yeah. But yeah, it was a lot of fun. There was this one, like, bridge thing, whereas, like, the, the trees themselves were holding up the the bridge. And I had a lot of fun on it. it. This is how I learned that I don't have a fear of heights, but my father does. That man li I did not move out of the way of that tier. That man literally scooted across the bridge by how scared he was while I was just skipping across. We got nine lives, but I would rather not get hit. Uh, Judgment? Judgment. Wish we could play it. Actually, we kind of can. We need to hit it. Hit it once. Get a key out of it. Uh, I like Scorpio. We like that. Oh, come on! Really? Really, game? That's what we're doing today? Come on. Uh, I'm gonna take this just so we don't spend a life. I was uncomfortable with the fact that I was, like, a foot away from it. But yeah, Anakisis was a lot of fun. Uh, after Anakisis, we went to Blake Sheldon's, like, Old Red. His little restaurant. That was actually really, really freaking good. Oh, I forgot to mention. After we went to uh, that, that blade forging place, we went to uh, Guy Fieri's Flavor Town. Which... I think it's the first damage on the floor. Let's Isaac open shops for free. I mean, we got plenty of keys. Which I gotta say, Flavor Town, little disappointing. Friends till the end. I gotta be honest, Flavor Town's a little disappointing. Face and peep. Flavor Town's expensive. Not not like I can't afford it expensive, but more like it's. What I got was a mac and cheese chicken sandwich, which was like one of the cheapest. I walked right into that, which was like one of the cheapest items on the menu, and it was still twenty one dollars. And it wasn't even great. Like, it wasn't a bad sandwich, don't get me wrong. But I would have definitely, definitely rathered something else. It was $21 for a mac and cheese chicken sandwich that 
tasted like it should cost like twelve dollars. And then and like the big pro pl for that place is that they have like a Dave and Buster's style arcade, but the rewards in it are not great. The rewards in it are like. Typical stuff you see like at King's Island or an amusement park, which I know I'm complaining about a lot and it's a first world problem, but I spent 50 bucks. Uh oh, it's a super, well, the secret room to the left of that room. Let's go pop that cherry. We roll pedestal. If we get the, uh, the present in the shop. But yeah, no, I, I mean, it, it was still fun. I still enjoyed my time there. But yeah, we went to Blake Sheldon's Old Red, and that was actually, like, phenomenal. I loved it. The sandwich that I got was, like, $17, and it was super good. It was a thick burger, too. And the and the ambiance of the restaurant is, like, really nice, too. Candy Heart Healing with a Red Heart Grants random permanent stat-ups. I'm okay with that. Especially considering we could just do this. <laughs> This is where Razor actually comes into play. Um, yeah, no, Old Red was super good. Had a lot of fun there. There was a live performance by a band. I don't remember the band's name, of, and I'm sorry about that. They were great, though. I enjoyed, I enjoyed seeing them perform live. Um, Nun's Habit would be pretty good, but kind of want the map. We have a two movement speed. That nice to have two movement speed. I, I have been struggling with Eden runs because like I, I get really good stats to set up, but then I get bad movement speed in turns, so it's like I just get hit by everything. Uh, might as well go into the super secret room and see what they got over there. And then the last day we were there, uh, we were leaving at 11, but we went to Paula Dean's family kitchen, which I, I gotta be honest, that had the most incredible... God dang it. They had the most incredible pancakes I've ever had. Their pancakes were so good that I didn't even have to, like, use syrup. I just straight up ate that. A uh, little delirium and a little abba dabba ding dong. I don't really want either of these, if I gotta be honest. I don't really want either of these. I think I'll just save my HP. So yeah, uh, Paula Deen's, where are we going? I'm guessing the boss is, is like right over here. So I think I just want to go down. So yeah, Paula Deen's, if you've never been there or heard of it, it's, it's a buffet style place where you order something and then they continuously bring it around to... Oh, uh, oh uh. they continuously bring... Oh yeah, that's what we were looking for. They continuously bring that uh, the stuff that you ordered again and again and again and until you're done. Money equals power. We like that. Having regeneration actually helps out, out a lot because we could just continuously use something like the razor blade. Um... Oh god, I hate those enemies so much. The Dank Depths are one of my least favorite areas in the game. Uh, secret room's right there. Ah! What? Ah. Ah. I mean, no way this shit's right over here. What? I'm not convinced. How, how did that... Huh? I'm confused. I'm confused and befuddled. Having petrified poop is gonna boost our economy a good amount. That guy's dead. You're already dead. Might as well complete the boss while we're here. It's gonna be Gish. Ah. Did not really want little Gish. I would have much rather a uh, actual boss item. 
Where are you aiming that, my man? Would have rather than an actual boss item, but it's all right. Old Gish can be accepted. You know what the Binding of Isaac graphics remind me of? The game Castle Crashers. Castle Crashers was such a good game, ahead of its time, really. Gish is gonna go down. Yeah, little Gish. Ah, there, little Gish. And I forgot about the spikes. Um, now nah, the shop's gonna be to the. See, they're gonna be right here. Yeah. Okay. Glad I checked this out. Yep, 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 yep. I will absolutely take mom's key. Um, don't have enough for anything else. Let's go down to the next floor. Mom's key is going to help us out a bit. Alright, where are we heading to? Uh, I'm going to... I'm going to head down... Our second time dealing with this room. All right, barely clipped me there. But yeah, overall trip was really great. Had a lot of fun. Kicked candy ass and pool. Getting some coins from petrified poop. Um, I'm not gonna do that. That would be a bad idea. Trying to get unlocks here, not skipping floors. Um, secret rooms to the north? Alright. Boss room's right there, so that's where mom is. Oh my god, we are healing so much! You see that shit? <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? What is happening? <laughs> I don't know how we didn't get hit. I hate you. I hate you, game. How did he live? Ow! I'm not a fan of this room. Oh, I don't know why I didn't go. Oh! I don't like how tight these rooms are. Taking a lot of needless statement, and that was my fault. That one was actually my fault. I will accept it. We're running low on soul hearts. I know that. Um, I actually kind of want to keep the razor blade. I will take you. Uh, kind of want to get it so hot. Just so we can be sure. We did not go to our item room real quick. Uh, we have plenty of time to make it to Boss Rush. Let's see, where the heck is our item room? Do we think it's to the north or the east of this? Try not to waste too much time. North it was. You tried it. I don't think we're going to face old BC, so I'm not even going to worry about grabbing that. That's terrible. Data miner, really? That's our final item room? At least candy, like we, uh, if you look at our stats right now, we have not gotten many stat, uh, have we gotten any stat? We got a range upgrade and sausage. <laughs> That's been our stat upgrades. That's been our stat upgrades this entire run has just been sausage and mom's mom's heal. Well, chew. Not been great on the uh, stat upgrades. Um, we have a lot of hearts, so I think I'm gonna go with the negative and go down to excuse me the lamb. Oh man, these are not great, but I think I'm I think I'm gonna go with Aquarius. 
Don't got a lot to work with here, but... We're gonna have to complete boss rush anyway. Oh god, you happen to walk right there, huh? Why does it have to be champion? I mean, it's like we got the movement speed, but why champion? Oh, you know, I didn't know Aquarius worked with Scorpio. You know, more you know, I did not know Aquarius worked with Scorpio. This is going to be a long boss rush. By God, it's Pin. Pin with a steel chair. This is going to be a long boss rush. Especially with us continuously getting champions, man. Champion horse God. Champion horsemen are not great to face. I am not a fan over the fact that we just continuously keep taking damage like that. Also not a fan that Candy Heart continuously keeps giving us these uh luck upgrades. I'd rather damage or tier upgrades, to be honest. Oh. Relax, relax, bloat! I gotta start collecting these hearts without using them. Dude, champions are not fun to face. Why do we have to get a champion boss rush? Tried it. Come on. There you are. Halfway through now. Champion again. Is it just champion? Yeah. Champions every single wave is unlucky. At least we have dead bird. Well, dead. Is it dead bird? Something like that. It's, it's the bird doing extra damage. Oh, God. Champion Monstro 2 is really unfortunate for us to face. Especially since it's the red one. Yep. Yep. Champion is so much faster. It's like Red Mom, how it's constantly stomping. Ooh. I really hope we're not, like, too low on HP. I don't want to accidentally die, not complete boss rush, and then be at a disadvantage where we just have one single heart going into every fight. Yep. Dookie. Oh, God. Is there a champion version of this guy? The dark one, is that what his name is? The dark one? Is there a, is there a champion version of him? Ooh. Oh my gosh, everyone's a champion. Surprised they didn't give me dark, uh, what was that, Gabriel or Uriel? Good Aquarius damage there. Thankfully, we keep getting more hearts to where we can keep ramping up our damage a bit. Eve's Mascara has been unlocked. Spider Baby. Okay. We got our asses handed to us. That boss rush took 10 minutes. We have half a soul heart? Oh, goodness gracious. We don't have great damage at base. Really glad that poison got it. Our movement speed's what's keeping us in this right now. Shot speed. Shot speed up? I don't really care for that. Yep, I knew that was gonna happen. Really use more soul hearts, to be honest. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. But we're down to one heart, so we don't get damaged suddenly. Honestly, it was a risk doing that in here. Oh. 
I did not want to be trapped with them. Judgment. Judgment. Ah, oh, why you? Fuck you. Oh, is that? I didn't even notice there was a library up there. I don't know why I'm blowing that up. Okay. Hey, I can work with this. I can work with this. Um, do I really want to fight? Who is it? Pestilence? No, it's not pestilence. It's it's not death either, is it? I don't know. You just gotta not regenerate any more hearts for the rest of the run. Alright. Yeah, death. Let's hope we can beat him. Gotta dodge these. Easier said than done, especially when he does that. <sighs> he really just Kobe'd my ass. Alright. Let's try this again. We're at one heart now. I'm just gonna hit him from the top to where he doesn't do that again. Alright. This is fine. This is A-OK. -okay. Do not worry. Got to beat, got to beat uh, Mom's heart and a few others. I guess we can. Eh. I don't really care. Let's just blow up both sides. See what happens. I was hoping it'd be to the right to where we could actually. Why do we keep getting secret rooms like this? Let's speed through this, man. Oh, another soul heart. All right, we're getting our HP back very slowly. We just gotta avoid taking damage. All right. Oh, another soul heart. Oh my god, game, you're beautiful. Did not think we'd find a sacrifice room, but I guess we gotta go all the way around. We still have petrified poop. Kinda wish we kept the uh, cross. This petrified poop did not help us out as much as I wanted it to, but that's not really petrified poop's fault. That's more of shops were not great. Sitting that good HP again. Super secret rooms in here. Facing a lot of champions. We don't even have champion belt. I want to say it's like right here. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Get an HP upgrade. Actually, do I even want an HP upgrade? If we get a devil deal... We get a devil deal, right? We're gonna spend the HP upgrade anyway. Huh? What damage this? Also, is this fight like canonically we are inside of our own mother fighting her? Do we like climb in her after beating her, her foot up? <laughs> Okay, um, what do we take here? Because Rotten Baby would be good, but so would... I think we take both, honestly. Okay, this is fine. We're all only on Soul Hearts now. We just gotta beat Satan and then beat the Lamb. Okay, where do we think our boss is? I think our boss is to the right. Yeah. Come on, give us something to work with, game. 
Oh, wait, we have flying now. That's right. Oh, our boss is right there. We went straight to the boss. Cool. Oh, my God. Where are you at? Uh, using a key heals half a heart, turns half hearts into full hearts. I mean, I don't really have any hearts, so. Alright, let's see if we can beat Satan with three hearts. One, two, three, four, five. All right. There goes one of our hearts. Oh my god, we're at one heart. Ah, damn it. It's going to be impossible if we lose this heart or if we die here. Oh, come on. Oh, Aquarius putting in that work. Love. No! I don't want to talk about it. I do not want to talk about it. <laughs> I'm just going to try to get as much HP as I can and go right back. Why did we have to fight Fallen twice on this floor? Technically three times with, with the Satan fight. I hate you. I hate you so much for that. You just couldn't die, could you? You just had to stay alive there. Fuck, I might as well just spend this life real quick. Our first tears up in the entire thing. What have I done? What have I done? I just spent three of our lives. This has been putting us through the ringer, man. That boss rush, this floor, this room alone, like... <laughs> What is this? What are these rooms? We've had to fight Fallen like four times. I had to fight Fallen like four times in the run already. Thanks. Thanks, Loki, too. You are very helpful. The two soul hearts that we've managed to create have been taken away. Once by Fallen, once by Loki, too. Now, how helpful. Might as well blow up the skulls. My goodness, has this run been fun.
At least the skulls are doing something for us. Might as well just blow up all the skulls. Temperance. I don't really care about temperance. Got a few more rooms to be able to get some stuff out of. I don't like those guys at all. Double greed. What a fight. Okay. We have a lot more damage now. Might as well go and try it. Alright. Um, let's do this. One... Two, three, four, five. Nuke first phase of Fallen, and then immediately get hit because for some reason it's impossible to dodge it. Okay, that was close. Did not know he could do that. Okay. I knew that was going to happen. Ah, uh, Satan goes down. Fuck Delirium. Fuck Delirium. What? What do you take me for, game? So now we just got to beat... We just got to beat the lamb. Let's see what our... Oh, hell yeah. Mom's knife! <laughs> this is gonna kill us real quick, but it's just to do that. Oh my god, we finally got something to work with after oh 45 minutes. Brimstone, you fucking beauty. I'm so happy to see you. <laughs> oh my goodness. By the way, we're doing this so that we can get, uh... So that we can get a bunch of charges. On this. So we can just get as much HP as possible. Sorry, Mom's Knife. At first I was thinking about it, but... Then Brimstone popped up, and you cannot. You can't. No, you, you, I don't think anybody would choose Mom's Knife over the Brimmy. Shard of Glass? I mean, I guess. We don't have any red hearts, though. Oh, my gosh. Huh? Damn, they're fast. What, what happens when we do this? A barrage of knives? No. No. It ain't worth it. That ain't worth it. You know, we should get, we should get, like, my Petrified Poop should work with poop, poop creatures. Oh my gosh, that was close. I really was hoping that Monstro would die from the, the lava guys, not lava guys, the brimstone flies. You know, it's good, I, I don't know, I, I shouldn't have, I've skipped a lot of money, I'm aware of that. I shouldn't have because I forgot I had money equals power. But man, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, <laughs> Jesus. The fact that we stayed unhit in there is just incredible. That gives us a health up, but also gives us a speed down. Did it give us two health up? I mean... Shot speed down, but... 
Damage up. You're goddamn right I'm taking that. HP is looking good now. Man, Dark Room was sketchy, but the fact that we did it. The fact that we managed to beat it. I was, I was so irritated because of the fact that we beat Satan, but we have infinite range. We beat Satan, but then it just didn't matter. I think this run's ready. Also, what is this? If you would have given me this room in the dark room, we would have died. We would have died. We would not have been able to beat that. The only reason why we're winning this right now, like, beat this room is because of Brimmy. And we get one more charge on Book of Revelations before we fight. All right. Before we fight the lamb, I had to do one more a little bit to me, huh? Huh, Cage? Golden Razor Blade? <laughs> Hear me out, right? Is the damage worth it? Because we would get rid of money equals power. I don't really care. Let's let's see it. Come on, Lamb. Give us your best shot. Wait, it's way better than money equals power. We have 16 damage right now because of it. Oh, you tried to cheat. Lamb's gonna go down. We are not gonna do a victory lap today. That is where this run is gonna end. Thank you all so much for watching. This was a tough run. I hated everything about about the uh, whatever the place where Satan is. That was terrible. But the dark room really picked it back up with Brimmy. See you guys next time.